Give it up. Um, oftentimes when I, when I speak and I talk about that, I always tell people, just imagine if we can all be in sync like that together. It doesn't matter what color you are, what race, what gender. Just imagine if we can be in sync like how we were just now. So my name is Terry Spain. I'm originally from uh, South Carolina, Conway, South Carolina, which is the home of Coastal Carolina University for those. So I'm like literally like five minutes from Myrtle Beach. Um, but I'm a military brat, so I actually grew up in Italy. I grew up in Naples, Italy, where my dad made me and my sisters learn how to speak Italian. And I still speak Italian to this day. And as Conrado can attest to, I always go back every year to talk to uh, my classmates, some of those who still live there and things of that nature. But I'm also a member of Phi Beta Sigma Incorporated with some of my uh, great brothers here. And I'm very, very honored to be here to talk to you young men because purpose is an incredible alarm clock. And so what I mean by that is when you have a purpose, because you all here have a purpose, because I hear some of you say you want to get your degree, that's your purpose. So it gets you up in the morning when you don't want to get up and say, you know what, uh, give me 10 more minutes. Because I know, I know I'm not the only one that hit the snooze button before. <laughs> so, but um, I've served 21 years in the world's greatest Navy. Um, the absolute best decision I ever made with my life was join the Navy. I, every time I go speak, um, I have a consulting business where I do a lot of speaking all over the world. And one of the biggest things and one of the main things that I do say is joining the Navy was the best thing. Because being in the Navy introduced me to my wife. My wife was in the Navy. She's from Louisiana. Never thought I'd marry a Louisiana girl, you know, but um, she's from Louisiana. We had one daughter. And also from that, the military paid for my education. Um, so I tell people all the time, in particular the people that I mentor, because I get mentored as well, and I'm going to talk about a challenge, but um, I had a mentor that said, hey, you know you can go to school for free. Why are you not in school? So he pretty much dragged me down. I, I enrolled in school because I'm thinking I'm in the military. I'm doing God. I don't need anything. But that made me a deadly person when you are educated and you, uh, you serve this country honorably. So I got my bachelor's degree. And one of the things that I want to mention to you all now is the military, even though I'm retired, is paying for me to get my master's. And that's what I'm doing right now. So I, I'm, I'm 44 years old, and I've visited 44 countries. Wow. So this is, this is that when you're sitting there thinking, and, you, and you're, you're thinking, saying, man, I, I can't do this, or I can't do that. Um, you have brothers here who can attest to not giving up because there's been times when you want to give up and there's been times when you say you know what it's over I'm done but don't do that that's the easy